This is the story of a horse that didn't win by a nose. He's a winner for his clothes. Well, I think Morstead is a bit like the Naomi Campbell of the modeling world. It took a month for costume designer Emma Sandham King to make Morstead's tweed suit. The former apprentice to Alexander McQueen did three fittings. Morstead is very patient, a very friendly horse, and I think he really just liked the attention. Sure, it was a PR stunt to publicize England's Cheltenham Horse Racing Festival, but who can resist a horse sporting a white shirt and tie, wearing a tweed suit with pockets? What does Morstead carry in those pockets? <laughs> oh, horsey treats, carrots. <laughs> Are they real pockets? No, he didn't think he needed to put his hooves in there. The horse suit required 21 and a half square yards of fine Harris tweed from Scotland. We haven't seen anything this snazzy on a horse since the time Scotland's tourist agency commissioned cardigans for a pair of Shetland ponies. I myself once dressed in plaid to match an outfit worn by a horse, but this takes horse dressing to another level. My only quibble is with the ear holes in the cap. Not quite up to snuff, a last minute alteration. We were debating should the hat go in between his ears or around his ears, and we decided that the ears should go through the hat. The whole outfit makes Morstead resemble a certain private detective. Will you tell her Mr. Sherlock Holmes would like a word with her? And if we could have a word with a talking horse... Oh, what a fool, what a fool I've been. You're not a fool, Morstead. You're a clothes horse. Ginny Mo, CNN, New York.